Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can create a fully working QR code within Microsoft Word. Here's the QR code I created a few moments ago and if you have a QR reader and you scan this in you'll find that this takes you straight to my YouTube channel. So let's have a look at how we can create working QR codes right within Microsoft Word. So the first thing that you'll need to do is head over to the website store.office.com. So visit store.office.com and this is the Office Store for Microsoft Office plugins. Um, there is a search box at the top left and what you'll need to type in is QR for Office. So QR for Office. This will bring you up to this listing here, QR for Office. Simply click on that result and you'll see that this is a free add-on. So it's completely free. All you'll need to do is have a Microsoft Office um, account, an email account that you can sign into, which if you have Office 365 or any recent version of Office you will have. Uh, you'll see down here that this is compatible with Excel 2013 later, uh, PowerPoint 2013 later or Word 2013 later. So you can use this plugin uh, in any of those applications as long as you have a version of Office that is from 2013 or more recently. So simply click on the Add button. That will be added to your account. And what you'll then need to do is head back into Microsoft Word. Make sure that you're signed in. So in the top right corner, you'll have the Sign In button. If you see your name as I do there, you know you're signed into uh, Microsoft Word. And then what you'll need to do to insert the QR code is go to the Insert menu. So go to Insert. You'll find this option in the middle that says My Add-ins. And if you click on that drop down list, you'll see a list of the add ins that you have used or have got. Uh, and you should see QR for Office included. So there's no installation, no local installation. As long as you have visited the website and clicked on Add and you are signed in into Microsoft Word, then the add in will automatically appear in this list. So you click QR for Office. This opens up a panel on the right hand side of the screen. And it's pretty self-explanatory. On the left-hand side, you have the option to have the usual HTTP or a secure HTTP. You also have uh, Mail2 for email links, telephone, SMS, uh, and so forth. And you can have custom ones at the bottom if you choose that. I'm just simply going to have uh, HTTP colon slash slash. Then in the right hand side, I'm going to type the address, which is www.youtube.com forward slash the tech train. So as soon as you've typed that in, you can see a preview of it appears below. This is a working preview and it just confirms the address that it'll be sent it to. Um, you can make a few basic changes. So the color, for example, you can change the color of the actual uh, QR code and you can also change the background color as well should you wish. So let's just make that um, something like a, a blue on a pale gray there. Um, you can also change the size. So here we can choose what size it is. This will be inserted as a graphic so uh, you can still resize, reformat it, move it around on the screen no problem at all. Uh, so there we are. You've also got this error uh, correction. This is basically the design of the QR code inherently has a uh, degree of error correction. In other words, if you miss part of the code off, if your phone is at an angle and you don't quite get the left hand edge or you just miss off a corner um, or part of it is damaged, it won't matter too much. Um, so there's built in error uh, correction. A high error correction obviously will mean that uh, the code is uh, there's a lot of repetition throughout it. Low means that the code is not repeated that often. I wouldn't bother too much with uh, with changing that. Medium 15% is about normal. And as soon as you've made those options, simply click the insert button below. Uh, once we've inserted that, we can close the panel on the right hand side. 
Uh, and as I said, this is a, a graphic. It's a normal graphic. You can uh, resize it. You can move it around. Let's just uh, change the wrapping on that one. So I can move it around the screen. I can resize it. I can rotate it. Uh, I can do what I like with it. <clears throat> and that code, if you try it yourself, if you have a, a camera uh, with a, a QR reader on it, which is a free app, uh, they're available for all mobile phones these days, um, and you were to scan that code in, it will take you straight to my YouTube channel. So that's a really cool, quick and easy way of inserting functional working QR codes directly into not just Microsoft Word, but Excel or PowerPoint, in fact, as well. I hope you found that interesting. If you did, please do give this video a thumbs up. It does help the channel. And of course, if you haven't subscribed already, then please do hit that subscribe button before you go. Thank you very much indeed for watching. I'll see you in the next video.